Monte system on our 2004 Diamante, and all Diamantes are essentially the same, consists of two fuses, fuses 12 and 13. One fuse will provide power to the generator relay. The other fuse will provide power to our charge light, charge indicator light. Also, there is a generator relay involved. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to pull both fuses to leave no power going to our alternator terminal. And we're also going to pull the generator relay. Let's step over to our generator relay. Our generator relay has been removed. Here's the empty cavity of the generator relay. I have a hot test light. We're going to, I can tell it's a hot test light because I'm touching the point to ground. I'm using a hot bulb style test light. Okay. What I'm going to do is start the vehicle. Once I start the vehicle, it will not be charging, but I will excite the field using a bulb style test light to that terminal inside the generator relay and you'll see the alternator start charging. So what I'm going to do first is start the vehicle and then we'll watch our charging voltage. Right now our charging voltage is a pitiful 12 volts. Just a bit of over 12 volts. Now what I'm going to do is use a bulb style test light. I'm going to excite the field. So I'm going to touch this contact of the generator relay. You will hear the alternator hunker down. You will hear the alternator load up. I'm going to merely excite it just for a second and you'll hear the alternator start to charge. You'll notice once I take the test light away, the alternator field is already excited and it does needs no further excitation. Are you ready? Here we go. Three, two, one. You can hear the alternator charge. Hunker down a little, and now we're charging. We're charging with both of them. And I no longer need my test light. If we're going to check our alternator's charging capacity, then we can use a hot bulb style test light as long as I have battery voltage to terminal to the terminal on the alternator. We'll be able to make this work.